So we are back and I have my blanket with me today because it is very cold in my room. Well, my office. And I am going to go up to the bridge, which I believe means I am going to go fight my rival. While I was grinding, I evolved Watt, our Clefairy, into a Clefable with one of the Moonstones I got in Mount Moon because it made things a lot easier. And because Clefable's cool. Look at that smug grin, let's wipe it off his face. Ooh. That's level 18. Holy smokes. I'm gonna send out Muffin, because I'm not bluffing with my Muffin. Sand true, okay. You know what, let's send out Quat. Quat can do this. Ugh, that pound doesn't do much, holy moly. That thing's pretty tanky. Luckily I'm also pretty tanky. Levable has, still has some pretty good stats in this, I think. I don't really... No, I haven't really looked up that much about G1. This is more like G1.5, because I believe yellow was a little bit updated from red and blue. Rattata, DG Taylor should easily take that out. Hit it with the low get, get low, get low, get low. An Eevee, okay. Just like in the show, he has an Eevee. Oh, that was really simple. Guess what, I went to Bill's and I got him to show me his rare Pokemon. That added a lot of pages to my Pokedex. After all, Bill's world famous as a Pokemaniac, he invented the Pokemon storage system on PC. Since you're using his system, go thank him. Well, I better get rolling. Smell you later. Nothing like Pokemon and a nice cup of coffee. This is Nugget Bridge. Beat all five trainers and win a fabulous prize. Think you got what it takes? I'm pretty sure I do. Bug Catcher. Okay, this is gonna be easy then. Bot's gonna whip some Caterpie butt. And that critical hit tackle did nothing. Spring shot fail and Caterpie down. I'm pretty sure I can take out a Weedle.
Oh man, those pound attacks are just like tearing through. Yeah. Man, y'all, there's like the weirdest thumping coming out, coming from outside my office window, and it is so annoying. It's probably why I've been like, mm, what? Huh? What? Huh? <sighs> Just trying to play a nice, relaxing video game in my afternoon, but my neighbors have to be annoying. Man, Quad is going to get a lot of experience in. This is going to be nice. Sand attack into quick attack. Still got the hit though, so that's all that matters. Is that that little smidgen of red HP. Nidoran female. I'll change Pokemon. Since I got that minus accuracy. You know, we're going to use DG Taylor. We're going to hit it with a low kick. Get low, get low, get low. Ah, it's not very effective. Okay, but it flinched. Let's try Karate Chop. Man, that thing crits like every time. Does Karate Show just have like the world's highest crit rate? That's broken. How could I lose? Alright, number three says he won't be so easy. Quick attack. Okay. The fable is a wall, a brick house. She's a brick house. She's mighty mighty. Maltese Ekans. I had a friend in high school. Her name was Ellery, and we would always call her Brick House, or I would always call her Brick House because she was such a strong person. Oh. Uh, you know, that actually would have been a really good name for my Clefairy. Well, now Clefable. I know I have an antidote in here. There we go. I have five. I don't know why I bought five of them, but hey. I was prepared. Oh no. Am I going to be free? No, I'm not going to get to be free. I'm going to have to deal with the rap. Rap was actually like really good back then at early levels. Now it's just kind of pitiful, almost. Another poison sting. They said I get poisoned a second time. Alright, so I've taken out two of this guy's Pokemon. Time for the third. Zubat. You know what? I have such a hate for Zubats. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna let Muffin make short work of it. I know Quack could use the experience, but like, after dealing with that many Zubats in Mount Moon, I think I'm done with the Zubats. 
It's... Oh wow, it lived. That's a sturdy Zubat. Wow. Smidgen of red health into leech life. And still a smidgen. Let's use quick attack and just finish it off. Ow, stomped flat. I got 210 Pokedollars. And into number four. Getting tired? No, not really. Quatsman making short work of y'all. Wow, that's a level 16 Pidgey. That's actually kind of impressive. At least for this stage in the game. Of course I have to get hit with a sand attack. Sand attack into the quick attack and do I hit or do I miss? Because that's going to define miss. It's going to define if I get to live this out or not. Oh, I got the pound. Okay. I'll to use Nidoran female. You know what? I'm going to take the gamble. Gamble again. Oh, I miss. Okay. The most annoying sound in the world is playing, guys. Ooh. Ooh. That freaking hurt. Uh, hmm. You know what? Let's get Chewy up in here. I think we're probably going to dump Chewy from the team at some point, but I want to evolve him at least. Uh, I know DG Taylor is the closest to being 18, but I'd rather a Gabe up there because I want Gabe to evolve. We have another Moonstone, so let's use it on Dylan. Because Dylan's going to evolve into a Nido King now. Man, as a kid, these evolution sequences were so cool, and they just got even cooler with the games as they progressed. I love when I'm like always drinking coffee in these videos for this playthrough. To you guys, it's gonna look like I'm drinking nine coffee coffees in a day or something. Junior trainer mail sent out. Banky. Quick attack. Aha, my Pidgey is strong. Holy moly. They got low. And it critted. Wow. Uh. Huh. Taking a big risk, but if I get the Hyper Fang... The Hyper Fang was good, okay. I think I might have to keep Chewy for longer than I thought. Just because that Hyper Fang is really nice. Weiss. Whoa! Too much! Too much, man! Too real! So Quad and Gabe are out. Congratulations, you beat our five contestant trainers. You just earned a fabulous prize. I got a nugget. Cool. By the way, would you like to join Team Rocket? Or a group dedicated to evil using Pokemon? Want to join? Are you sure? Come on, join us. 
telling you we have can- I mean, I'm telling you to join. We have candy. Okay, no convincing. I'll make you an offer you can't refuse. You're not the godfather, bruh. I love how they all have whips. There's like... Get in there, Pokemon! Do it! Do it past or I'll whip you! Actually, that's kind of sad now. I think Team Rocket being on this game is really awesome. It kind of sets it apart from Red and Blue. I mean, a lot of things set Yellow apart from Red and Blue, in my opinion. I don't think you could do the Rare Candy glitch in Yellow either. But Yellow was just such an amazing game for me. Okay, good. Supersonic did not hit. Because if that hit, I'd be like, wow. Second Supersonic used on me in the game, and both only have 35% accuracy. Huh. I know I'm good. Why, baby, I know it. With your ability, you become the top leader in Team Rocket. How about I, how about I lead myself instead of following y'all? I'm not good at raising Pokemon. I should release my Charmander because I haven't raised it well. If you promise me you'll care for it, it's yours. Yeah, of course, bro. You want to give it a nickname? Uh... You know, I'm gonna name it Victor because it's flaming and so is my friend Victor. Victor! There's no more room for Pokemon. Victor was sent to the Pokemon Box 1 on the PC. Took good care of my Charmander. I found a TM43. Okay, so I found a Charmander. I am actually very happy about that. That's why I'm going back right now. I think I want to train this up. I did not know I got a free Charmander there. That's really cool. First wheel. Alright Pikachu, jump up on there. Some people box their Pikachu and don't even use it, but... I like my Pikachu. I think it's like an essential part of the game here. Let's check on you. Hey, buddy. Turn on the PC, someone's PC. So we have Chewy, Muffin, Dylan, Gabe, DG Taylor, and Quad. Honestly, a really hard choice on who we want to put back. Gotta keep Quad. I want to keep EG Taylor. Do I want to get rid of Chewy or Dylan or Gabe? Let's get rid of Gabe. Let's take out Victor. Take a look at him. Okay, he has Amber at least. Come here, buddy. Run in center. Okay, let's go to the Pokemon, right?
I'll buy two Pokeballs. Three potions. Okay, I think that covers it. I just got down from Mount Moon, but I'm ready. Get down. Get low, get low, get low. Okay, it's a hiker. Fatty Fatty Boom Blatty sends out Watch Out. And I think I'm going to send out. Send out Dylan. I love the hiker. I love the hikers. Like big old dudes, and they're like manly men. I don't know why, but I always like the husk the husky appearance of the hikers. Like they're just really big. Really big guys with the backpacks with all the rock Pokemon and the fighting Pokemon being like, yeah, I'm gonna whoop you. About to use Geodude. Nah, let's keep Dylan, he needs experience. Get that double kick. Too easy. One crit, one regular hit, that works for me. You worked hard. Holla holla, $525. What's in this grass? I wanna know. I wanna know. Can I get a wild Pokemon? Please. Oh my gosh, it's Bell Sprout. Victor. Oh, he's going to use growth. Pokeball go! Bellsprout was caught. Pokedex data will be added for Bellsprout. I'm going to give a nickname now, Bellsprout's fine. I should have named him William, actually, after William Bell from Fringe. That was a good show. Although Fox kind of flubbed the last season. The last two seasons weren't that great, but still, all in all, it was a good show. Critical hit. Still not very effective. Wow, can this Bellsprout stop getting crits, please? Yay, I got one level. Let's... 
Do this. Okay. So as a rule of thumb, I normally like to go around the grass five times just so I can well find five Pokemon in the grass. So I can make sure I see all the different types. So we have an Oddish. Hopefully this doesn't kill it or crit or anything. Uh... Well, back around until I find an Oddish. Ah, that was easy. was super effective. Alright, no crit. No crit! Okay, so... Pokemon Go! Oddish was caught. Cool. New Pokedex data will be added for Oddish. It may be mistaken for a clump of weeds if you try to yank it out of the ground. It shrieks horribly. Oh. That's terrible. Oh my gosh, that's awful. Why would anyone do that? Okay, so I'm gonna go around two or three more times just to make sure that there aren't any more Pokemon in this bush. Now that I have an auto, I should more than happily take the crit. Baby! No, no crit. Okay, this is number one, and it's just a bell sprout. I highly doubt I'm gonna find anything different here other than Oddish and Bell Sprout, but I'm gonna try. Special Rose, because special attack and special defense were on the same stat in G1, which was broken. At this point, Scratch will probably do more. The split for special attack and special defense didn't come till next generation, and wow, that was a strong Vine Whip. Cool, our victor is 13. And after this next Pokemon, I think I'm going to exit this grass. Okay, good. I didn't have to go around, like, around the grass rectangle 10 times. Ooh, see, I was good to wait. It's a Venonat, and it's level 16. Holy moly.
Oh my gosh. Pokemon go! Ah. Normally the Pokeballs turn like green, but you guys see this one's like purple. Oh well. I'm not gonna read too much into it. Its large eyes act as radars. In a bright place, you can see that they are clusters of many tiny eyes. Nah, it's not really that creepy. Transfer to someone's PC. I'm gonna go around one more time since I found a new Pokemon that time. Okay, well now all the Venonats are coming out. Well, this is just gonna be some good experience then. Sable failed, cool. Oh, it got burned? That's cool. Well, you know what guys, I'm actually going to save here, since... I found a couple really good pokes. I am going to go back to the Pokemon Center, heal my Pokemon, maybe do a little bit of grinding for Charmander, and I will see you guys in the next one.